um, uh, you know, sometimes a, you know, a sense of loss. I've lost friends. Governor Pritzker talks of just how the pandemics affected him and what comes next for Illinois. He's not following the lead of some other governors canceling mask mandates and reopening everything. The governor sat down with our political editor, Mike Flannery. Good to see you. While awaiting his normal turn to get his COVID-19 vaccine, the Democratic governor laments those who plan never to get vaccinated or to wear a mask, claiming one man made those numbers bigger. From the moment that Donald Trump began to politicize this virus, uh, I have uh, felt like in addition to the hurricane that hit us all, we now had this added headwind. Among Republicans blasting the governor's handling of the pandemic, Congressman Rodney Davis focuses on long delays in processing unemployment benefits. When you hear that criticism, what's your response? We upgraded technology. We brought in many more people to answer phones. But again, when you have 10 times even the Great Recession numbers. How many weeks is the, is the callback? Depending upon the type of call that they're making, it can be within the day, it can be within the week, or it can be within two weeks. For the most complex situations, we're talking about sometimes 45 days. The vast majority of states in the United States have experienced exactly what Illinois has experienced. Pritzker notes a hoped for summer reopening of the tourism hospitality business, Illinois' second largest employer, is not entirely up to politicians. And, and I think it's very important for us also to recognize that there are a lot of people who are still afraid, and I don't blame them. Both the governor and Mayor Lightfoot are working on a special July edition of the Chicago Auto Show, which might herald the return of tourism here. I'm political editor Mike Flannery.